from the time you spray a detangling spray in your hair, you're expecting that your hair is gonna get soft, it's gonna detangle. I was spraying water in my hair. Welcome and welcome back to my channel where I break down the fundamentals of my hair care. So guys, it's a product video. <laughs> you guys know I absolutely love product videos I love to come and share my experiences with you about products that I've been using now in this video however uh, these are gonna be products that I have been side-eyeing like products that I had high hopes for but they sort of let me down they sort of disappointed me so I just wanted to come and do this video I thought it would be fun just for you to see how products react to my hair there's a famous saying within the hair care world I'm gonna start it off I want you to finish it for me what works for me exactly it may not work for you so these are my experiences just gonna share them in random order and yeah this video is probably more entertainment based than informative based but but regardless I'm still gonna let you know what's up all right so let's go product number one now this product here is by Gabrielle Union dear Gabby you know we've watched Gabby growing up and I'm like fellow black woman creating products for black hair we gotta support so anxious I was so anxious to try this but I'm not gonna count this product out I'm I'm gonna give it a fair chance and see how it works on my hair. Gabby girl, I just hope that this works good on my hair. <sighs> so this is actually the Smoothing Blow Dry Cream by Gabrielle Union, her flawless brand. And I wanted this because normally when I blow dry my hair, right, I tend to add a cream before. If I don't add a cream, my hair is gonna come out dry. So I use this on three occasions. And to be fair, the three times I use this product, guys, <laughs> <laughs> my hair was dry like I'm, I'm wondering why the heck did I even buy this because I put it on my hair and it's a good thing that I keep a hair journal right because the times when my hair felt dry I look back and this was the common denominator this was the cause this was the culprit as to why my hair was so dry and I was like yeah I gotta throw this away this is this is not staying with me and to be fair I didn't really see a lot of good reviews about this now I don't know how many other persons do this but you would buy a product and then afterwards you go and do the reviews hmm. I did that and it was to my detriment but it's all good so yeah I'm so sorry but this this definitely has to go and the consistency of it was so thick as well so I was really expecting it to be moisturizing so next on my list is the Silk Elements Mega Silk Olive Heat Protection Spray with Silk. Again, I saw this online and someone was reviewing it and it left the hair really silky. Really, really, really silky. And I don't think I'm gonna side eye this completely, right? Because the times that I did use this, I think maybe one or two out of the times I paired it with this. So if this obviously was having a drying effect on my hair, I didn't particularly give this a fair chance. So um, the fact that I don't blow dry my hair often, I can't can't really get to you know to feel this product out a bit more but before I discard of it definitely I'm gonna try this out again I, I can't remember it doing something wow for my hair I don't want to write this off as yet you know I want to give it another chance so I'm gonna give it one more chance and I'm gonna see how it leaves my hair um the good thing is it's for relaxed and natural hair and it says here dry hair listen whenever I see products that say dry hair I reach for them because hey a lot of us here have dry hair some of us here like really dry all right so the next product that I'm giving a side eye right is the Proclaim Professional Care Olive Gloss and Polish. So <laughs> again I saw this product on someone's video and the person was going on and on and on and on and on and on and on about it saying that it's their favorite um you know serum so I wanted to give this a shot because for a good while guys I've just been utilizing my John Frieda as my primary serum so I wanted to see if there's something out there comparable or you know something that you know can can just give it a little bit of of edge this didn't do it like <laughs> 
this didn't this this did not turn from here like i put it on and let me tell you what it felt like i put it on my hair my hair looked shiny instantly it gave my hair this kind of like silky kind of feel but let me tell you at the end of the day my hair felt so dry absolutely dry so it's like how do you have my hair feeling silky but my hair is dry though how that work how, how does that work it's full because i hardly 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 use it after realizing that it just did not do much for my hair so and then again come to think about it my hair and olive oil ugh not the best of friends really not the best of friends so uh yeah i have to give this away i'm i'm, I'm gonna give it away maybe it, it would work a lot better in um for someone else's hair type so let's talk about the my black is beautiful moisture locks detangling spray right now i bought this solely because of the packaging don't judge me like don't judge me i'm a stickler for packaging i thought the packaging looked so luxe so beautiful and you know it says my black is beautiful like you know I, I felt like they made it for me you know so that's why i bought it and the gold and it just looks just looks gorgeous you know this disappointed me huge disappointment you know from from the time you spray a detangling spray in your hair you're expecting that your hair is gonna get soft it's gonna detangle it's gonna feel you know a little bit more manageable i was spraying water in my hair as a matter of fact i believe that water would leave my hair feeling a lot softer than how this left my hair like i'm so disappointed with this i i gave this maybe two tries and after that i was like nah mm -mm, not risking it anymore with my hair this just gotta go and it looks so nice like why you gotta look so nice and be so terrible for my hair but while we're on detangling spray let me come in with this one so this is the moisture miracle this is by african pride it's a coconut milk and honey hydrate and shine leave-in conditioner this you gotta gotta shake gotta shake to activate like we like these kind of things like it feels like you're you know you're building the product so you're shaking shaking yeah i really like this anyways so i bought this because uh the this what's it called what's it called guys the pre poo right so i bought this because i i bought the pre poo and the pre poo actually is it has a lot of slip the pre poo has so much slip so i was expecting because they're in the same line they're in the same range i was expecting a similar sort of results again water it feels like i was just adding water to my hair so of course when i was doing like a detox of my hair products i was looking at ingredients because i bought all of these products to be honest without checking the ingredients right my bad it happens all of us do it so i'm looking and of course both of them have in so hey here's the one with the my black this has in golden milk with honey and coconut milk this one has in what's it having this one has in coconut milk and honey so coconut oil me and coconut oil you know have a love hate relationship and these products are like complete with, pro with coconut oil so of course they didn't really work as well for me and again they are full <laughs> Like, you know, like, if you're somebody that budgets, somebody that, you know, it's all about the coins. Like, when I look down and I see all these products that I have to give away, I'm just like, seriously? A couple hundred? Maybe not a couple hundreds. But it's that money. It's money that I could have used elsewhere. But it's my fault at the end of the day. I should have looked at the ingredients, right? I should have watched reviews. But, hey. So, <laughs> there are two other products that I don't have. I already gave them away. And I just wanted to talk a little bit. Actually, there's three. It may be three. It may be three. Three products that I've already given away that just didn't work for me. So, two of them are deep conditioners. One being the Eden Body Works deep conditioner. I was looking at a particular channel. Somebody that I admire within the hair care community. I love her. And she was reviewing this product. And she was, you know, speaking all the truths about it. She loved it. And I said, okay, I'm going to try it. Now, the day I was about to try the product, I got two pieces people random they don't know each other one message me i say girl that product ain't nice it left my hair dry another one came out saying that oh you know i had to give this a little longer on my hair to process with heat because the first time it just wasn't working so of course i got a little worried but at the same time right i'm here saying well you know it may not work for them but it, it may work for me Guys, I, I, I gave this 40 minutes. Normally I deep condition for about 20, 25 minutes. I gave this an extra 40 minutes because of what I heard the girl say, right? When I washed out my hair, tell me what, tell me why my hair felt dry, like drier than when I started washing it. I'm gonna say like, what, what me put on my hair? <laughs> What me really putting on my hair today? Because I couldn't detangle my hair, first of all. I was in the shower almost having a breakdown because I'm just like, okay, um, I'm, I'm not 
two, three weeks post relaxer, you know, I have a bit of new growth and my hair needs to be detangled. So I'm having a conversation with myself now, like should I wash out and then deep condition again? Or should I just wash out and just hope for the best? So there I'm battling right and left part of my brain, deciding what to do, deciding what to do. I was like, hell no. Hell no. I am not washing out this hair to go on deep condition again. I gave this 40 minutes, 40 minutes. So I wash it out. I put in my Shea Moisture because my Shea Moisture always comes through. Tell me why again my Shea Moisture is here struggling. <laughs> my Shea Moisture has never struggled before, but it's either body works have my Shea Moisture struggling to moisturize my hair. Listen, that day, that was a terrible wash day for me, right? That was a terrible, terrible, terrible wash day. A similar experience happened with the Miel Babu mint oil I think it's called I'll, put, I'll post a picture um that I didn't realize it was a protein based deep conditioner left my hair feeling dry I I just I, I couldn't I, I just I couldn't anymore so of course I gave that away as well now the third product I gave to my mom it was the uh what is it called it was the as I am double butter cream I gave this product a chance to the point where I utilized the whole tub of this product and then I went and I got another one. My hair was not dry but my hair did not feel moisturized but I, I think I in my mind I so wanted the product to work and I know a lot of us are like that. We want to continuously give products a chance. After a while I said nah this, this can't work anymore like I'm not noticing any benefits from you. Gave it to my mother. My mother tried it came back complaining as well and she has natural hair. So you know we got rid of those products. Those are just not for us. We're not using them. I, I just went off on a whole rant there just all right about the Eden Body Works. It's a bit too emotional. Let somebody will let me know if the Eden Body Works works for them, but boy, that thing disappoint me, boy. Really disappoint me. Anyways, so these last two products, right? <laughs> I did a whole dedicated video on them, and one of them I absolutely loved. The other one I just couldn't. I, I, the other one I, I couldn't stand it, right? But it's still here, thankfully. So I get to do a video on it, right? So this is the ORS Olive Oil Max Moisture Super Moisturizing Daily Styling Lotion. Oh my God! Use this three times on my hair, and the three times I use this on my hair dry. That was the same week I was doing the review of the product, and I, I gave it a chance, and this thing just dried out my hair. Anyways, I'm not going into too much details about it. If you want to know um, my honest thoughts on it, you can check out the video. But this, ain't using this again. Full, again, another full, full, full product. Just gotta go. Now this one is the Super Silkening Leave-In Conditioner. I ranted and I raved about this product, right? Because this product left my hair feeling so silky, feeling so soft, right? So soft. Then <laughs> someone called me, right? And told me, um, Adina, I put this on my hair, but it felt good going on and then afterwards it just felt dry. Like in the same breath when this person told me this, I saw like a couple comments coming under the, the video saying the exact same thing. Like it felt really good going down, but when it dried down, it just didn't feel right. So tell me why I'm scared now. Like y'all got me frightened. Like I frightened, frightened to, to go try this again because the fact that I paired it with this, I don't know if afterwards that, you know, this sort of gave me a different result because of this, you know, or vice versa, whatever the case is. But now I'm scared. I'm frightened, bad, 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 bad. We're gonna try this again. Suppose I try this and it's terrible on my hair. So right now I'm between minds. I want to give it another try, but I don't know. I don't I don't know, I don't know. Why, why y'all have to do this? Why y'all have to do me like this? Seriously, why y'all have to do me like this? Uh, but yeah, that's it for today's video, guys. Let me know if any of these products work for you. It will be interesting to know how they react to your hair, seeing that they just did not react good to my hair at all. Of course, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, like this video, share this video with a friend, put on your notification button, and of course, I will see you next week, Sunday for another video all right take care bye these products i'm not gonna throw them away i think i'm probably gonna just give them to, to persons because what works for me may not work for you or what does not work for me in this instance may very well work for you